so in this video i will discuss about this particular error which most of the people face while installing homebrew no such file or directory opt homebrew bin brew so uh, what are the debugging steps we can take to resolve this issue so first uh, approach which uh, we need to consider is first check what is the chip type for your mac system so it can be the intel based system or the silicon based so we can check this by going to the apple icon on the top left corner then about this mac then you will have some value for chip so if it is intel based system then you need to check in the z profile file if you have put this opt homebrew then it will it is the reason for this issue because for intel based systems this should be the value there and also if you have run this command in the terminal then also it will give error because it is searching for opt slash homebrew which is valid for silicon based systems not for intel based systems so please be mindful sometimes we just run this without noticing this that whether it is a intel based system or silicon based system so this is the command which we need to run for silicon based system and this is the command we need to run for intel based system so this is the only difference between these two commands still you face issue then you need to run the brew doctor either you face still the issue or if your system is the apple m1 or m2 i mean the silicon chip based system then you need to run brew doctor so it will it will diagnose your system regarding the homebrew and it will list down all the issues which are causing this particular error even after running this brew doctor command if you didn't find anything useful or it didn't get fixed so what you can do you can just uninstall this homebrew completely and then again install this so uninstallation is pretty easy so i will give this particular link in the description also so if i go to here so this is the one line command which you can run on terminal and uh, you can uninstall the homebrew then you can install the homebrew again by running this particular command so i hope if you follow these things this error will be gone if still you face issue please let me know in the comment section